Welcome back to Kerbal Hard and Uncut, and we are just trying to rendezvous at the moment with a with a crowd. I need to just get this sorted out. Um, we need to get the RCS on and get a bit of slowing down happening. Um, oh, actually, you know what? What am I doing? RCS off. We need to actually slow down significantly. I didn't realize we were going this fast. It's, uh, it shows you that I've. It's been a while since we've. Uh, I've looked at this. I, I sort of stopped it in mid flow. So we are attempting to rendezvous with a craft with the aim of um, hopefully uh, getting getting the the pilot out of it. We've got a, a mission to uh, to get the pilot, and it is um, is it Yoga Kerman? That's it. Yeah, we so we chose Yoga Kerman because um, historically, I think. There is a, a Scott Manley uh, thing where he had a Yoga Kerman in in his in his series. I I think so. I, I can't remember. I'm probably I'm probably miles wrong there. All right, we're going to move as close as we can. We're going to use a bit of R RCS to do that, um, and then we'll just uh, we'll zero out the the speed when we get nearby. Right, a bit of that, a bit of that. Get in, get in nice and close. That's going to be a lovely, wonderful, perfect. That's within six meters. Okay. So there we go. That's going to be good. Turn the RCS off. We're going to put ourselves on the on the retrograde there. Uh, so as we drift in in the next three minutes, which is is too long for us. So we're going to we're going to do a bit of timey wimey warp um, and get closer. And when we get close enough, we will just uh, pull it out of timey wimey and we'll uh, we'll put ourselves in. So we're going to get within five meters, it says. And I could probably I could probably stay a bit further away than that. We could get the jetpack out and go across. But you've seen my jetpacking skills. I just realized actually our antenna might be a bit of a problem. So we're going to just we'll just rotate the craft. There we go. That's better, isn't it? Just uh, don't want the antenna getting in the antenna, the uh, solar panel getting in the way. Um, so, yeah, so we're going to do this. We're going to hopefully get this Kerbal, get them down. Um, and that's, I don't know whether it's a pilot engineer or what. I mean, obviously, we um, we do have a scientist to replace because James is still on holiday, obviously. Um, we're not entirely sure when he's going to be back from his holiday. Um, he's gone caving or something. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what uh, what, he's, what he's going on about personally. I think it's a bit excessive what he's doing um, personally. But, you know, that's, that's James for you. Very selfish. Um, all right, I'm going to spin this round to about there, turn the, to, nope, not that, that there. I'm going to rotate the craft this away so we can actually get into it a bit more easily. Where's the, yeah, there we are. Right, okay, we could just do it like oh, that. It's probably the best way. Right, and then we can, can jump across. And what have we got? What are you? Are you a pilot? You're an engineer. Yoga Kerman is an engineer. Pretty sure that's not true. Pretty sure you are a, oh, we can actually just wait until we rotate around, can't we? And then we'll just bump that off and then, da, da, da. Go that way and that way a bit. Yep, there we go. That way, down a bit, down a bit, down a bit, that way a bit. Grab, in we go. Are we on boarding that? Wonderful. Um, we can actually jump to that. We can change this to uh, change it to junk debris. There we go. We don't need it anymore. We're going to get rid of it. Right. Um, I guess it's time to, to head on home, as it were. So uh, put us into. Uh, let's see, we want to go into orbital mode. We're going to go retrograde. Where do we want to come down? Oh, actually, you know what? We could... No, that's not the space station I want to go to. Oh, hello. What's what's this here? What we got? We got... That's the Woomera. Okay. We, oh, we could go there. How much Delta V we got? Yeah, actually, let's do that. So we want to come down in the sea about there. Uh... That's good enough. Right, let's go. Let's let's go fly a kite warp to there. I'm not sure if that's going to be enough. We we may end up putting a bit more. Oh, there's the the moon. We could dip into the moon if we really wanted to. Right. Um, I think what we'll do is we will actually get rid of that to start with straight away. Um, and then we'll just we'll just speedy weedy through this through the system. So we've got the heat shield on, haven't we? Yeah, thank goodness for that. I realised I couldn't remember if we'd actually put a heat shield on this thing or not. Um, go faster, please. Right. So. We have three days until the Moho or Bust arrivals. Um, I'm going to have to remember the name of who built those craft. I'm probably going to forget. I apologize. Um, I know there's two of them. And I, it's been a while since we actually set them off on their journey. So I need to do that. Um, do I want to set some other, other things for you to do? Yeah, Eve. Anything to do with Eve. Missions to Eve. If you've got craft for Eve, that would be brilliant. What else? What else would be interesting? Um, I think I've got Elu sorted. Maybe something for the jewel system. Dual system would be quite interesting, I think, because primarily I am. Um, 
I've not really done much around Jewel. I was actually thinking of doing a, a little series about some of the Jewel planets and doing like one-off missions to them. Um, but of course, we're going to have to go anyway with this. So yeah, crude Jewel sort of landing. Tylo. Tylo is the one, isn't it? So anybody got anything for Tylo? That would be wonderful. That would be brilliant. Um, I think these boys are going to end up in the in the drink. I say boys. We've got Yoga as a boy. We've got Belene, who is a girl. Belene is our, our number one pilot. Hi, Belene. Oh, you're getting very excited. Are you, of course, you're getting excited. You're, you're warming up a bit after the... Um, Shall we say the the difficulties of being on orbit for a while? Because you were you were on orbit for quite a while there, Berlin, weren't you? Um, there goes the oh, it's gone off. It's exploded. That's an interesting view, isn't it? It's like the um, the shade has gone a bit funny there. Interesting. The mist, the mist and the sunlight. I don't have any mods on this, so obviously that is just stock. I was just wondering whether it could be something else. So probably fire the other parachute about now, just in case. Just you know, in case I forget because. Um, yeah, I should. I do like the arming ability that you have with um, with the some of the mods, uh, real parachutes. I think does it you have the ability to arm the parachute and stuff. Um, I know that the stock ones sort of do that now, but I quite like the the ability to set things accurately. I know I could go in and do that with these. Actually, you know, you can do altitude set. Oh yeah, you can actually, can't you? Hmm. Um, so we could do that. And I think a lot of people change this to like seven hundred and fifty, particularly for speed running. They'll try and cut it down as low as possible, but yeah, I think uh, we're, we are speed running, but we're not speed running. So let's get this down. And then I think it's going to be Moho Captures time. I think we're going to be, be looking at putting those together. So right, slow this down. Last 10 seconds all the way. Good stuff. We completed. We got Yoga. He's caught. We've got Yoga from orbit. Good. Right. Can I, can I recover that? There we go. So let's see if the actual load screen is any quicker today than it has been on other days. We've been having a nightmare with this load screen. And I don't know whether it's to do with the fact we've got a few different uh, craft flying around now. Maybe I have to go and cull those in between episodes, cull them out. But I think we've got stuff going on. So, yeah, I also need to keep an eye on where Drez and Kerbin are because I think we could transmit science back from Drez right now, um, which might actually complete a mission thinking about it. What was the Drez mission? Um... Science data from space around get ooh oh that's surface science space around now that's good that I like the look of we're going to go to Gilly I've already said we need to send a craft to Gilly uh, I think once we've got the Moho ones uh, situated I think we'll go Gilly um, that's in th see this is a one that I want to do as well I do want to put a station up there and I do want to do some science on it. Um, so that's that and then there's the gilly one do do i just pull the trigger and invest in i think we do i think we invest in that that facility actually i think we're going to have to it's half a million though it's going to take a massive chunk out of it but it means we can sit on contract which uh yeah so the dres one is surface in 30 years we'll have that we'll have the space around gilly and we'll take the uh, orbital science moon one now what's this one I'm going to leave this because it's going to keep coming up. I know it is. Um, we're going to leave that three tourists to around the sun, around the sun, Eve. No, we're not doing that one. That's not happening. Right. So we've now got those contracts that we need to be aware of. But let's bring up the alarm clock. Uh, do these contracts come on here? They don't. So we need to be aware of timings. Let's have a look. Um, orbital station around the moon, Gilly. Those are starting to get on now. you got four, four years for that and 37 so the, the comets one we could actually run out of but i think we basically we're covered by our advance which is okay if we took it again we'll get it now that's got a lot of time I've got mystery goo on gilly which we're gonna have to do anyway so the science on gilly's fine and then the moon we've got that 41 percent still we've got this one where it still hasn't got any so we're gonna have to go back to the moon anyway I think we'll combine that potentially with this, the orbital station. We'll use its parking stage to drop in, and then we'll possibly have to send another craft with a mystery goo to do some collection there, which is annoying. Anyway, let's get out of there. We've got time to uh, to jump to these things and uh, switch to. So we're going to finally go back to our 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 moho or bust missions. Finally, it feels like it feels like forever. It's probably about like what fifteen days or something like that since we set them off in in Earth time. Um, and I yeah. Uh, yeah, if, because it's so long. If I was just doing these missions on the run, right? So this is the one that, yeah, okay. This is the one that's got, does it have, is that it landing legs? I don't know if it has landing legs. I think it's just designed to drop, isn't it? Um, right, so this one, 
has the solar panels there and it is facing the wrong way. So we need to turn it around before it dies. Um, and it is using a bit of power. So let's just rotate it around. So I think this one was actually positioned originally. Um, and there we go, we're gonna get some electric, yeah, there we go, we've got, we've got electric charge, good. Um, this one was originally positioned to do that. And of course we, we swapped out one of the, one. Of, no, go back. Go back, please. Thank you. We swapped out one of the devices, I remember, for this thing, which I don't think it will actually do anything, but uh, it's it's nice to have it, isn't it? There you go. Right. Stay there. Stay there. Right. Good. Wonderful. You're getting solar power, right? You're wonderful. Right. So you're going to be our first arrival at the Moho system. Let's have a look. When are we going to get there? Let's let's uh, let's warp. Let's do a bit of warpage. Um, it's it's in a few days. Uh, how fast do I want to warp this thing? Um, I suppose that alarm will kick in, won't it? So there we are, there we are. We're, so this is us. This is, um, oh, this is Jimmy Magucci's one. And then we've got, I've named them. And then the great Trog, Trog, Trog. The great Trog is after. So that's Moho Bust or the Moho Lander. Cool. So we can see now, if I remember rightly, there was some debate on how good you could actually do this with this. I think Jimmy, Jimmy commented, I think, and uh, don't hold me to this. I think he commented about the fact that with his, it was a bit, it was a bit touch and go. He he'd done it manually, I think. Um, so yeah, so we'll we'll just walk there. So he said he got it as a bit of a manual, I mean a manual capture. So yeah, we'll we'll see how this goes. When is the next? When is the next one coming? So that's four hours away. Okay, so this this might be. Um, we'll have to have a think. Let me get into the sphere of influence at least. Yeah, okay. Delete and close. Right. So now we're looking at the next one if we need to. So I'll go to there and uh, I'll walk to that. Right. It's got about a minute. So once we get into the sphere of influence, then we can actually look at focusing on, on it. Here we, here we are. Good. Right. So we need to do a burn here, there. Add maneuver. We're going to be we're doing a capture burn. We just want to capture straight away first of all. Right. What's it going to take? It's going to take 3,400, which is not bad, actually. Um, I could go looser. I could go looser and then change inclination. But I'm going to want to land on, say, the sun side here. So we're not going more hauling, are we? Is the more hole? Is that, is that the more hole? Where is the more? Is, is that the more hole there? I, I don't know. I know that the, there is the more hole. Is it? Is, it's not there. It must be in the top. Looks looks like a crevice there, isn't it? Um, we'll go in. We'll go looking at the Moho in the future, maybe in a separate mission. All right. Um, so that is start burning. Oh, so it's actually quite quick. So we we, we can actually just do that. Then we're gonna go, we'll warp that there. Let's check the craft. Is it is it getting sunlight? It is. Um, now, how much science on board do we have? We have two canisters, so we can do one of these. Um, <clears throat> we can do one of these. Low? I, you know what? We're gonna actually gonna miss the, the the high science, aren't we? We'll have to grab it with the next craft. We'll have to hope that the next craft has the ability because this thing does not have a lot in the way of stuff. Right, here we go. Um can't do seismic. Uh log pressure. Uh we're gonna we're gonna where where is this? Is this is high, so we're gonna keep that experiment. Uh temperature. Uh log temperature. We're gonna keep that experiment. Um, oh, I, I just, so we're going to be in this, this sort of altitude, aren't we? We're going to um, observe the mystery goo. Uh, keep that experiment. Is there anything else that we have on here? Did did he actually put it on action groups now being retarded? Um, let's have a look. Uh, let's have a look. Ooh, can't do anything with that. Uh, right. Let's have a look. What's our... Ooh, milestone. Uh, space... There's a flyby moho. How exciting. Uh, rescue... Oh, that's the one from before. Okay, we didn't delete that. Right. I'm going to leave that up because we need to be aware of that. And I need to swing this thing round. It's going to be quite a long burn, I think. I didn't realize we were still so high up. I thought we'd gone closer. I suppose Moho is very small, very small. We've got 50 seconds. So do I have chance to, to fire these engines quickly and get... Yeah, this is, a, this is a big burn. This is a long burn. So I'm getting the feeling that you will probably see this burn completing at the start of the next episode, I'm guessing, because we've only got about 36 seconds left. I've, I've wasted time doing the science stuff. Um, I wonder if I could transmit anything uh, while we're here, you know, being being as we have this ability. Uh, can we transmit that? Are we getting, uh, review the data. Can we transmit it? Okay, so I guess we're charging the batteries at the same time, so that's good. Let's do that. Um, 
let's review that and transmit that. Uh, transmit that. All right, we've got about eight seconds left. We're going to get the temperature data while we're going. Um, we're going to review that. We're going to transmit that. All right, so from me, until next time, from Moho, have a great one.